The Flathead tonight, a proposal to build a 122 lot mobile home on Evergreen Drive has surrounding neighbors fearing their homes will lose value. On top of that, with the road already seeing heavy traffic, they worry about the safety of themselves and the children who live there. MTN's Nicole Miller reports. Rob Treat and his wife purchased this home on 89 West Evergreen Drive less than a year ago. He says it's their little slice of the American dream. My wife and I are second time home buyers. Um, so this is a home that we want to be able to, you know, make it our make it our home to where we want to be able to build it up and then also pass it on to someone else eventually. He says the home is valued at around $233,000, but with a 122 lot mobile home subdivision being proposed on the 33 acres adjacent to his property, he says he fears its value will drop. It would be different if it was if it was housing, you know, because there's more more spread out where people can, you know, develop and the people can buy as opposed to renting. Treat says one of his chief concerns is an increase to the traffic. The area, he says, already sees a heavy amount. You take 240 people plus, you know, plus their children, plus their dog, plus their cat, you know, and you, you now have to compete with 240 more people on this road to be able to get in and out of here. A private traffic study conducted by the landowner found no significant impact if the subdivision moves forward. Mark Musman, Flathead County Planning Director, says traffic could present an issue. I think it, the traffic is definitely an issue that, that uh, is real. And it's part of, of the criteria that can be used to say, uh, not the right time, too big, Go back and see how you can mitigate the traffic issue. In Evergreen, Nicole Miller, MTN News. The Flathead County Planning Board will have a public hearing Wednesday, April 11th on the request for the preliminary plat approval. A repeat of a public hearing for the proposed mobile home park has been rescheduled to May 1st because the Flathead County Board of Adjustment will not have a quorum for its April 3rd meeting. County commissioners are going to make the final decision in this matter.